good morning everyone <clears throat> sorry how are you all doing today today is day 12 and it is Sunday and so we're doing our meditation a little bit later and I love waking up on Sundays early because it's so quiet outside I know I've talked about this before, but I think it's so it's so important to talk about uh, noises, I think. Um, and please let me know if you relate to this, because this has been something that I've mm, struggled with, and sometimes I don't really know where how to go about, because noise is something that we have everywhere all the time i don't think it's possible for us to live without noise because if it's not like man-made noise it's natural noise from the earth and the animals and the other beings that are living on the earth and that's what I hear in the morning. Like it's really, really quiet here in the morning, but I can hear the birds, the birds are talking, and there are some cars, but it's not very loud compared to like a regular weekday. And it's it made, makes me think about how we have noise around us all the time. It doesn't matter what we're doing there is some kind of noise whether it's we're talking to someone we're listening to music we're listening to a podcast we're watching a movie we're going outside like there is noise everywhere there is so much noise pollution in the world now and a few weeks ago i was just going through this period of there's too much noise. Like I'm surrounded by too much noise. I can't process anything that I'm going through. And it's also one of the reasons I really appreciate these silent meditations because it gives me the space to process my thoughts. And even though, don't get me wrong, guided meditations are amazing and I do do them once in a while, having that time to just be as quiet as possible is like a sense of liberation it's a sense of freedom like this weight is lifted like we don't have to hide anymore and i'm always someone and this is coming from someone who has a very strong sensitivity to noise so like for example i can't stand fireworks there's just I just can't um, and concerts and things like that I love them but I can't get too close like my ears get super damaged if I get really close to the stage and just things like that uh, parties and clubs and things the noise is just too much like I, there's too many things happening at the same time and I just can't handle the everything that's going on I can't process it and so for me silence is so important and so I love like natural sounds when I go and that's why I also love spending time in nature because it's natural noise like if we get away from civilization enough it will really just be you know nature and you and you'll hear yourself walking on the earth, you'll hear yourself breathing, you'll hear yourself the wind whispering, you'll hear the, the insects buzzing around, and you can hear the birds and you know any other animals that are around you because it's like a unity, it's working all together. And, um, and it's just, it's, it's, I think it's so important to 
kind of pause and think about that how much noise we surround ourselves with and i'm and i've definitely been guilty of this of spending of because i don't want to um concentrate on something or focus on something whether it's like an emotional um emotional work that i have to do on myself or it's just me procrastinating or anything like i will definitely use like external um stimulation to get me to not process what i need to process like music or tv shows or movies or whatever just kind of some sort of like noise stimulation and visual as well really kind of like you know it it gives it puts like a cover over everything that's going on but instead of it being external it's an internal cover so it's like a that's just should be it should be like this <laughs> it's like an internal cover which doesn't allow us to fully be present for ourselves and i've i've noticed myself like i've caught myself do this i know i used to use uh when i was younger i used to use uh, tv shows as a way to escape just because of i was depressed and i wasn't in a good place and w my situation wasn't ideal so i would use that as like noise and visual escapism and i've caught myself do that recently instead of me watching a show like consciously because this is a nice show and i want to keep watching it it becomes binge watching or it becomes uh procrastination or whatever and so instead of like giving me time and space to process through the emotions and process through um the feelings or the work that I need to do or actually start planning or start creating or whatever I need to do I'm stuck in this noise loop and then when I finally turn it off it's like I've it's like this veil gets taken away from from my reality this veil just like yeah of that I was stuck in this noise I was stuck in this distraction that we've created for ourselves instead of being real and centered with who we are and being real with what we're trying to create for ourselves and so this is why i really love these these meditations these meditations of sitting here being fully present with ourselves and sitting here just listening listening to nothing and that's the point right we want to be able to hear ourselves and so we're because we have so much noise around us all the time when we try to listen to ourselves we expect our inner voice to be like super loud and we expect our inner voice to be clear as to what you know we want from ourselves and that's not the case our inner voice is this shy quiet little being in the corner and that's that's what our inner voice is it's this little small piece in inside of us and for us to be able to listen to this voice we have to get really quiet and we have to spend time with ourselves to be really quiet and that's why we do these meditations every single day we come here and we sit that's why we do these meditations and I shouldn't whisper now because <laughs> then you won't be able to hear me. But that's pretty much what I wanted to say as an encouragement and an inspiration to keep going, 
wherever you are in your meditation journey this is so that you can learn to be connected to you so that you can be more in tune with yourself and your thoughts and your intuition this is why we do this every single day so let's get practicing together I invite you to grab a comfortable seat whether it's on a pillow or a chair and just get yourself ready with your journal with your beverage water tea whatever you need I'm gonna give everybody a few a minute to just get everything together And I'd love to know, I'd love to know if you resonated with anything I said, if you also feel like there's too much noise and if you are just as sensitive, um, I'd like to know who you are uh, because it's important, it's important, you know, to speak up and to share those things and it's okay if you don't like that loud noise and it's okay if you do too. I mean, that that's everybody's different right but we don't we don't need to like fireworks we don't need to like loud noises we don't need to you know if you're like me like I am a total like nature lover and honestly my dream is to one day live with the land and to be part of the land and to not need all this extra noise and that's the beauty of it so let's find a comfortable seat we can close our eyes or find a drishti a gaze point on the floor in front of us And let's take three deep breaths together, taking a deep inhale. Exhale, let it go. Deep inhale. Exhale, release. And last inhale. And let it go. And let's take a few moments now to just feel ourselves right here in this moment. Feel yourself sitting on the earth or your feet firmly planted down onto the floor. With each breath that you take, you slowly start to feel your energy land. Taking deep breaths, feeling your body breathe in and out. Gently relax your jaw, relax your shoulders. And I want you to start listening to everything that's outside of you. Listening to the noises outside. What can you hear in this moment?
And after taking some time to listen to everything outside of you, I want you to turn your attention inwards. Listening to everything inside of you. And you can move back and forth between your outer experience to your inner experience. But give yourself this time to just listen to anything that comes up. At the end of the 10 minutes, I will let you know when time is up. And we'll slowly come out of the meditation together.
taking a deep inhale, filling your entire lungs with air. And exhale, let it go. Slowly start to wiggle your fingers and your toes, bring soft movement back into your body. And when you're ready, you can gently open your eyes. bringing light back into your vision. Thank you for joining me for today's meditation. I invite you to journal about anything that came up and the different sensations that you had when just sitting here and listening to yourself and to everything around you, how that made you feel, if you felt uncomfortable or not, and just any kind of sensations in your body. Hmm. So thank you for joining me. I hope you have a beautiful day ahead of you. And I will see you guys soon. I will see you tomorrow. Yes, Monday. Monday tomorrow for day 13. Have a nice day, everyone.